5 a.m. on the pier at Port McGee. Not even the sun had stirred in the South Kerry sky. But the local boatmen were already busy here, bringing crew members on location to Skellig Michael. Of course, for the stars of the movie, a 10-minute shuttle to Skellig Michael by air was preferable to a one-hour crossing by sea. Nice and relaxed here. However, the helipad on Valencia Island was heavily guarded from prying eyes by courteous security personnel. So where were they all going? The UNESCO World Heritage Site Skellig Michael with its 6th century monastic settlement and spectacular Atlantic views. We wanted to go too. Unfortunately, a two mile temporary exclusion zone is in place around the island for everyone's safety. Please just, if you can just stay outside, two miles outside Great Skellig, that's, that's all. Thank you very much. Star Wars Episode 7 offers an opportunity to display some of Ireland's most wonderful scenery to the world. You've got generations that will, that have enjoyed Star Wars, have followed it, and I think you'll have them coming to the island for many years to come. We've seen the impact the film um, does have on other areas, particularly Ryan's Daughter and Dingle, the field. Um, so it's great to see a global production come in and, um, you know, showcase our island and South West Kerry. Filming of Star Wars Episode 7 has wrapped for the day and is expected to conclude here tomorrow. Pascal Sheehy, RTE News, Skellig Michael, County Kerry.